painted in 1971, the present lot is an early work from Rameshwar Bruta's seminal ape series, which he continued till the end of the decade. It marks a move from his earlier works of the 1960s, in which he portrayed the emaciated bodies of laborers, emphasizing their anguish and indignation as a means to examine the poverty and economic disparity he witnessed in everyday life. In works such as The Present Lot, he uses greedy apes and hybrid ape-man figures in wryly comical settings. They become a satirical commentary on the corruption and decadence of India's bureaucracy. His characters often resemble what art critic Rubina Karode has described as the pillars of society. They are government officials, officers and havaldars, or military officers flagrant in their consumption. The artist has said that these bureaucrats had accumulated more than enough to get by luxuriously and their lack of sincerity was responsible for the deprivation I had been painting about. That was when the image of the apes came to me and I began a series by that name. Ruta's aim in using the figure of the ape was to show the animal instinct that supersedes the civilized exterior of the ruling class. Titled The Lost Self, the present lot hints at a mankind that is still in the throes of evolution and yet to shake off the primitiveness of its ancestors. Bruta bifurcates the canvas into two vertical planes and uses neat contours to delineate a topsy-turvy world in which an ape, positioned upright, swings gleefully towards tables and chairs that have been turned upside down. A shattered glass in the corner emphasizes the chaos that has been wrought. Despite the seriousness of the subject, the artist brings in levity through a bright color palette and the elongated caricature of the ape. The present lot is an astute example of Bruta examining the misuse of power and wealth in society in his ape series. Bid on this lot and other works by leading modern and contemporary artists at Saffron Arts Spring Live and Online Auctions on the 13th and 14th of March 2024.